So just some tips if you're going to shoot some fights, always make sure that you arrive early if you can because um, you need to understand what lighting you have available to work with so you need to review your area and then also you can scope out where you're going to shoot as well so if you arrive early without anyone not many people around then you can you can uh, work with what you have there the second tip that I would say would if you if possible have a fast camera because um, then you're able to shoot action shots and low light photography. I highly recommend that. But if you don't have that, then you know, it's always what, do with what you can and with what you work with, especially shooting at uh, theaters. It's usually quite bright there, so you can usually get away with it as well. Uh, the photographers that I would recommend for you to follow and to have a look at, to follow their work because it's really inspiring, would be uh, Scott Hirano, uh, Julius Fu, uh, Pari Arafa, uh, the local Thai photographers in this scene in Thailand is uh, Jojo Mortals. Jojo's very good. Um, also Panom. Panom's really good with his action shots as well. Um, and there are a few other fire photographers. William Liu in Australia as well. He's very good. And um, you know, all of our work is different. So give them a follow because I would highly recommend it because. Um, then you get to understand what sort of action shots uh, different people do and you can work with that and make it into your own as well. So my name is Helen Tran and you can find me on helentran.co on Instagram. I'm working on a project called Chief Fights which highlights the disparity between uh, female fighters in Thailand.